Hello and welcome back to chapter 6, lecture number 28. So we applied the material and texture on the base root and the branches and now it's time to apply the twig. So let's click on the branches and I got, want to go to weight paint and let's go to the wireframe and edit mode. So the idea is that we add a new vertex group I call this uh, fields maple and we're simply going to select the branches and it's very important that you won't touch the, the big root just the surrounding uh, branches it's pretty good to handle just turn it around and some of there I think this is uh, looking good. So I like to assign this on a field maple. And when we go to the solid view, it looks like this. This is perfect. So object mode. So this is ready to have a particle system, field maple. Yes, call that. I want a field maple as well. Up there. <laughs> Just a quick typo. Yes. All right. Check, check, double check. You want to have hair and advance. You want to check that there is a randomness and you want to emit from vertices. This is very key that you pick this, and it's also because uh, the reason why we increase the bevel. Uh, and curvy details. So we have more richness on the tree. So do, 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 we go to render. We want to have collection. And we start with the twig field maple A. There you go. And we'll go to rotation. And let's use a normal. And we need to randomize the normal. That one is not doing what I want. So let's check. I want to face them downwards. So maybe we have to just, yeah, that's much better. But some other ones have now issues. It's always finding a sort of good balance, what looks the best. So I want to have an amount of 6,000. So that will cover the tree in 3.5, not quite sure. All right, so you can minimize this one and duplicate this. And you want field maple and click the two. And let's give this a name like A and B and score A. And field maple and scott B. The more you organize, it's easier to find your work. And I want to have an amount of 2000 to start with. And change the twig to B. Yeah, that's smaller. Do, 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 do and do some scale remnants of 0.1 so some twigs are bigger than other ones and we should just do the same with the field maple A 0.15 and you can enable it again right so let's give this a quick render in Eevee all right well it's not bad at all Maybe the leaves the leaves are a little bit too big, so I'll go for 3.1. And that one, oh, there's a typo as well. 3.1. I want to restore that. 
let's just disable these and we have some performance all right come on it's not that heavy maple and we can enable it again and this is the small twig and then we have the big one look at that this is just a wonderful tree created with blender with a sapling tool i love it uh, sometimes you just have to say that because it's good what we create twig field map maple a i want to increase the specularity a little bit because it looks a little bit too diffuse to me and we have selected so go to the shading tab and i want to render it again so the specularity should be more yeah that's too much but seven will uh, will fix it just wonderful and you we want to do something else we want to have some color variation so let's drag that note over there and duplicate this and add color UE and saturation and color into color and we want to add a mix shader uh, color mix mix RGB <laughs> it's running late here I think so there we go and we want to add an input and object info and go to add uh, color mix RGB and you want to add the randomness into the oh no 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 we want to add color UE and saturation so randomness should be in UE into the saturation and the value and then you put this one this color output into the factor but it's hard to see so we have to make it purple to find the right value all right so let's do make this zero yeah something like this value will do so the purple area will cost a different color so if we put our color into the color 2 from the second texture and we want to have something like 0.57 so there is more green inside of this tree so it's not fully yellow but uh, yeah isn't it wonderful yeah it is all right so in the next lecture we will do some organization in this file um, yeah and uh, we will uh, discuss what we created and uh, then we almost finished in chapter six so uh, see you in the next lecture bye bye